For creating this safety balloon here, I just created a subdivided plane and added a bunch of modifiers. When I disable all the modifiers here, you can see it's a flat object. This wouldn't look as nice if I wouldn't use a vertex group. In the displace modifier, for example, we can see this vertex group field. You can click inside and pick a vertex group from the vertex groups which you already added to the object. And you can see without the vertex group, the whole thing looks kind of weird because this specific vertex group defines that the strengths up here should be weaker than down here. And let's go over to the object data vertex groups. Here we find the thickness vertex group. And whenever we assign vertices to a specific group, we can define the vertex weight. As soon as we switch over to weight paint mode, we can see this nice heat map by default. And the weight paint mode allows us to paint the weight directly and dynamically onto the surface. 